Welcome back everybody. Today I'm going to be checking out the uh, uh, old style texture pack. This is a 64-bit texture pack. This is the texture pack which we pretty much used the hell out of over the last six months. So it's uh, typified by this particular pattern which is present in almost all of the uh, uh, or definitely all the hardened holes, that much for sure. So we're going to take a little uh, swing around here. This is the new Ship 3. You all will have seen it before. Be also sure to check out the other texture pack review videos. So far we have done the pixel, realistic, cartoonish, and now this one, the old style uh, texture pack. This is what we would call sort of the classic, I guess, because it was with us for so long, over these last six months. And a lot of people love it because they've grown so attached to it. Of course, people do air, uh, build their ship for a particular texture. And sometimes it can be useful to tell people which texture pack you're using so that when people load your ship in, they see it as you see it. So, uh, as you can see, we've got some lovely chairs here. And it's the first time we've really taken a good look at this chair for uh, the entire of the series. But that'll come later in a separate series of its own. So we're going to come down into the engine room, get a nice base test. As you can see, this was actually built in this texture pack. So the way the lighting is and how it reacts is kind of optimized for this texture pack. And it does kind of show. It's a lot brighter. Um, it does make me kind of worry a little bit because when I wear, I super brightified the downstairs because I usually play in pixel myself. Oh, so taking a look in here, it looks like somebody's and already stood on the news. He's ready to do the news show for me this week. And his name is XJackXV. <laughs> so we're going to move out of here into the sports desk. And as you can see, oh, it looks like someone here is right, waiting to give me a race report. Lord of Nightmares, Jack, and Zeus are all here helping me out today, so thanks for that guys, modelling the uh, news desks. So then, hey. back down we go, I'm going to go back, check out the grass, because everyone needs grass in their life, in fact I think these are flowers, so uh, just make sure you check out those tulip bees, I'm going to go down here, check out this texture pack room. As you can see here, this is all of like the thing which everyone's always been associating with Star Maiden, this texture. The normal hull, which everyone is so used to. It's almost a shame to see it go. Um, and so it's still here. It's an option in the launcher. You don't need to download anything to get access to the old stuff. It's right there. There is a drop down list for texture packs. So we've got every single uh, shape of the game Tetras, Pentas, Corner, Hull Wedges, Hull Wedges, and Hull Blocks going through all the different colours normal on the side we're looking at now with glass at the end and then on this side we have the different colors of plex light with all of the hardened versions of the same set of five blocks so those are the uh, texture pack uh, the whole types of colors we did have a bunch of power supply computers and terrain here but there were some technical difficulties during the filming of the realistic texture pack so uh, the, uh, luckily, the the, yeah, luckily the crew managed to put the fire out, but we've kept it here to demonstrate the damage to blocks. As you can see, there are these little grey things, and they increase in density the more damaged the block becomes. Different texture packs handle this damaged effect in different ways, usually by layering these over the top of each other until the blocks eventually removed. So at the back, we've got some terrain. And a tree with some tree leaves. Yep. Over here we've got the uh, ice crystal, which is currently emissive. And then we've got some ship systems along this side. We've got the missiles along here. And then the AMCs. Of course, here we have the... Oh, what one is this? Power supply? No. What is that? I forget which one that one is. Probably one of the missiles. They're all kind of like the AMC we're looking at in there. Just a this was a repair or salvage. Is it repair? Is it? Yeah, well, it's salvage there, so it would make sense if this was the Astrotech beam. Uh, yeah, there's some got green a, on it, so. So we've got a build block up there, and we've got some water, and we've got lit and unlit. As you can see, you've got a slightly different dynamic there in the way it's rendered. 
There was also some technical difficulties during the filming of the uh, cartoonish texture pack. I think my ship killed me. I think there was a disintegrator block here and I accidentally uh, crashed it. into it. <laughs> a little bit. You nicked it. This is lava with sand next to it, so you can see the difference there. And that's pretty much everything to say about this texture pack. Um, like I say, we've moved on to higher definition things now. Um, but yeah, uh, that's pretty much the old style texture packs. You can use this as a baseline to compare. Um, but for all, most, most, in most situations, I'm using pixel or realistic if you want to get fancy. Um, but I do play with the pixel because it's just a nice smooth, smooth colours. So anyway, thanks for that. Uh, when more texture packs come to our attention, I'll be doing them again in the same style. So thanks for watching. And be sure to check out the cartoonish, pixel, realistic. Yeah. Yeah, that's all of them. But thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.